Hey guys, and welcome back to The Last of Us. When we last left off, we were trying to make our way through these uh, government goons, of course, after finding out, um, should we say, Ellie's little secret. Now, <clears throat> this video should have gone up yesterday, which was uh, New Year's Eve. So, <laughs> today it is uh, New Year's Day. Shocking, I know. So, Happy New Year, everybody. But, uh, I had a bit of a problem. Um, well, we seem to be having lots of problems with uh, this recording uh, pipeline. But, I had a new problem crop up where my microphone sounded like dog shit. Utter dog shit. I mean, I've got a Rode MT microphone, which is really quite good. Uh, for this kind of stuff. I mean, yeah, there are better mics out there, of course, but it is a really good mid-range microphone. And um, it sounded echoey and tinny, and all you could hear was the, the deafening fans of my computer. Um, and I spent about a day, yeah, almost the whole day, trying to work out why... My microphone was crap. I tried drivers. I tried different USB ports. I tried opening the room. And I thought, There's my mic, it didn't used to sound like this when I recorded the first two videos here. Something must have happened. Like, what's happened to the house? So I tried leaving my uh, studios. I said, yeah, ooh, that sounds, sounds fancy, doesn't it? My studio. My uh, recording room's door open. I'm thinking maybe the, the, the sound would, was reverbing somehow um i tried hanging heavy big blankets up i started looking at soundproofing and sound boothing stuff which is very fucking expensive by the way and it was only when i came home from work today i sat down and i tried recording again i tried listening to the mic again and it still sounded awful so i slumped back in my chair my gaming chair Utterly defeated. I looked at my microphone. And I noticed uh, my microphone was facing the wrong direction. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. That was the problem. My microphone was facing the wrong bloody direction. Now, <laughs> to be fair, it looks identical no matter what way you're looking at it, apart from the fact it says road on the front and on the back, it just has like serial numbers and stuff. So, yes, I am a stupid ass. So, anyway, without any further BS and waffling, let's get into this game. There's so many of them. We shall use our... Ellie, we are going to use our superior intellect. There's too many tests. Do we have? Yeah, we do. We got bricks. Go over there, guys. You're give me the brick. Give me the brick. Give me the brick. Sneak, 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 sneak. Uh oh, dude, what are you doing on that car? Seriously, this. What is he doing on that car? You utter plum. Hmm. Also, what is going on with that tank that's destroyed outside? How did that happen? How? Oh dear. Come on. Come on. There we go. Get him. Get him. Get him. Oof. Okay. That was close. Shit. Now we've roused a little bit of suspicion. Yeah, right. Well, there's no point being careful about this. Yeah. Oof. Oof. Yink. Ooh, hello. Nope, nothing in there. Don't worry, ladies, we got this. I think. Ooh, shit, you sneaky. Sneaky, 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 son of a bitch. Where are you? Oh, ooh, ooh, ooh. Hey, bullets hurt. Who'd have thunk? Okay. Fight smarter, not harder. Come on, you stupid bastard. Come to daddy. There you go. 
There you go, there you go, there you go. Come on. A little bit more. Yeah. Oh, you little sausage. Uh, I don't know why we had no sound effects there. But that was interesting. I just bricked a guy to death and there was no sound effects. Oh, God. Careful, careful, careful. Where's the other guy? Oh, there he is. Why? It's still showing that I've got a brick in my hand. Damn it, come on. Hide from the bullets. Yeah, that... I thought my brick broke. But I was also wielding it. Okay, that was a weird glitch that I haven't seen before. Yeah, so this Bradley, or whatever it's supposed to be, um, has been destroyed by zombies somehow. This is concerning. The zombies are obviously much more powerful than we originally thought. Like, even if it ran out of ammo, it could still run them down. Okay, it doesn't look like it's been abandoned. You know, it hasn't driven as far as it possibly could and then run out of fuel. It doesn't look like that. And I guess you could say, oh, maybe, maybe the spores got inside. But they all have chemical filters and things like that. So, I... Oof. I can't see that being an issue. Hmm. Am I overthinking? I am overthinking, aren't I? Anyway, let's go, Joel. Let's go. We can contemplate... Yeah, the finer points of military hardware. And their vulnerabilities to the walking dead. Later on. When we've got more time. Ladies? Um. Oh, good. I was concerned for a minute that you may have perished. Whilst we was contemplating weaponry. Yeah, this looks right. Hmm. Stay close. Well, I mean, it kind of looks right. Out of the rain. It doesn't look like I'm looking down the barrel of a gun, which is... Uh, I mean, that's progress, surely. This place probably smells really mouldy and damp. Hmm. You can almost taste it. You know that stagnant air. Oof. Have a look. I think we can squeeze the It air. looks dark, guys. It looks really dark. Let's have a little look for supplies, shall we? Anything. Anything at all. Because supplies are always good. Shit, shit. I got more soldiers. Target's still on the loose, sir. Break off pursuit and report back to sector 11. I don't think they see us. Acknowledge. Get to your vehicle. Stay in the shadows. Yeah, I think we're good, guys. I think we're good. I think we're okay. Cool. Let's go. Up and over. There we are. Beautiful. Alright. Well, luckily, the soldiers seem to be going back to base, which seems a little bit short-sighted, if you ask me. But then I suppose two fugitives probably aren't that important. Okay. Alright, let's check this place out. What have we got? Kind of an interesting mechanic to this game as well, on the PlayStation 4 version. You can shake the control pad uh, to recharge the torch. Well, actually, I assume you could do that on the PlayStation 3 version as well. Because they had similar tech. Ooh, bullets! Are we safe? Bullets. No, they're still around. But take a moment to catch your breath. We are never safe here, Joel, Ellie. see if there's anything we can use in here. Sure thing, We are never safe. Do you know why? Because there's freaking flesh-eating zombies um, inhabiting our particular universe, Ellie. So safety will never be guaranteed again. I mean, maybe there are uh, zombies in our reality as well, guys. It's just we haven't encountered them yet. Or maybe we have. Maybe they are the uh, the drones walking across the street, holding their phones to their face. Scrolling social media um, in between the traffic, which I actually do see a lot of that as well. Uh, some of the drones I see crossing the road, and I hate to call people drones, but, you know, exercise some uh, amount of brain power. Like when you're crossing the road, put the phone down for five minutes. Or, or five seconds is all it takes to cross the road. I mean, it's okay. Y you'll be fine, I promise. You're not going to miss anything that important on Facebook. But you might, you know, not die. 
Yes, up through here through this pipe. I think Unbelievable, like honestly. Stay very close, Ellie. Okay. I mean, there are people that literally cannot put their phones down. It's bizarre. Such a strange phenomenon these days, social media. Bit of a poison that's crept into our society, if you ask me. There are good sides of it, of course, but... Ugh, we're not going to go down this tangent. Back to the wall. Alright. Well, that's good for us. Hopefully they're going to be off our backs for now. What was the plan? Let's say that we deliver you to the Fireflies. What then? Marlene, she said that they have their own little quarantine zone. With doctors, they're still trying to find a cure. Yeah, we've heard that before, huh, Tess? And that... Whatever happened to me is the key to finding a vaccine. Oh, Jesus. That's what she said. Oh, I'm sure she did. Hey, fuck you, man. I didn't ask for this. Me neither. Tess, what the hell are we doing here? What if it's true? I can't... What if, Joel? I mean, we've come this far. Let's just finish it. Do I need to remind you what is out there? I get it. Ooh. This way. If we cut through downtown, we can hit the Capitol building by sunrise. Yeah, well, that sounds like a plan. Oh, and listen to this music. This music is incredible. It's so melancholy. It's so hopeless, but beautiful. Hmm. I love it. I love the soundtrack to this game. It is absolutely phenomenal. But anyway, we're going to sneak through here. Because there's a little summit summon that we want to get our grubby little hands on. Hmm. There's something, alright. Yeah, that's pretty crazy to think about. They actually had to bomb their own cities to, well, I wouldn't say survive, but prolong their existence. Interesting stuff. Um, okay. Well, there's no connection to Facebook out here. That's for damn sure. But there are still a few things that can connect us to what happened. Let's have a little look, shall we? Evacuation leaflet. Federal warning. Huh. Warning. The area immediately outside the Boston quarantine zone will be subjected to saturation bombing in the next 48 hours to eliminate any threat of the infected. All residents of this area will have 48 hours from this notice posting to evacuate the Boston city limits. No one will be allowed into the quarantine zone. We're not accepting any new residents at this time. There will be no further warnings. For your own safety, you must clear the area. So, basically, you're not allowed in our qu uh, quarantine area because we have no room. And you can't stay where you are right now because we're going to bomb you. So basically, you have to fuck off into the wilderness and take your chances out there. Oof. And that's the government speaking. Well, yeah. 
That's the government speaking. I'm not surprised, to be fair. Ooh, we're getting some lag. What's going on with this lag, man? My poor PS Pro. Ooh. Uh, what the hell was that? Test, you hear that? Yeah. Sounded pretty far away, though. Damn. Are we safe? For now. Come on. We are never going to be safe again. That's for sure. Holy hell, look at this place. Well, there's the Capitol building. Yeah, we need to get around this mess. This is the downtown area? It was. Now it's a giant wasteland. Was the downtown area? Hmm. I guess there's nothing holy about this place. Apart from the floor. <laughs> I'm here all week, folks. Alright, come on guys, let's go. The old stone building? Over here. Huh. Random ass name. Alright, come on ladies, let's keep this party wagon going. And there we are, up in the tree. We have another... You find anything over there? Firefly pendant. Keep looking. So... You just stay oh, close come to on now. Joel. Thank you. Three bullets on that. Probably wasn't worth it. So, anyway. Firefly. Joseph Lenz. 113. Mm-hmm. Okay. Your bloody pendant just cost me three precious rounds. So, anyway. Uh, we did collect some supplements. So, why do we have healing and crafting speed? Already unlocked. Did we start the game with healing and crafting speed unlocked? Um, I'm confused. I know I had to load the game because uh, I had that video that I recorded that was unusable. And we just collected our first supplements. And I did start a new... G I was going to say, was it a new game plus? No, it wasn't. It was just a new game. Okay, maybe that was a pre-order bonus. I don't know. I have no idea why we have healing speed and crafting speed already buffed. Not sure. Um, but supplements are vitamins. <laughs> vitamins, yeah, sure. Uh, that we can pop. And we can permanently boost our skills. And all of the skills, all of these um, passive buffs are useful. Some more than others um, but yeah so we can actually permanently uh, upgrade Joel which is actually really good because we can upgrade shivs and we can make shivs shivs are knives they're one hit kills they are extraordinarily valuable um, and a little bit later on not even that later on actually we will come across a shiv door think of a node room from um, uh, dead space you have to give up a shiv and you can only get into the door if you've got a shiv. Think of a shiv as a key. But they always have good loot um, inside. So shivs are very useful. Also, there is an enemy that we shall encounter later on in the game. That if it grabs you, it's a one-hit kill. But if you upgrade your shiv master ability, you can uh, unlock the ability to counterattack as long as you have a shiv. So shivs are so important. Always make sure that you have one on you. If you can, of course. Hey, Tess. Coming. Oof. Well, that doesn't look good. Spent cartridges on the floor. Empty magazines. Oh, my. Ripped apart. Body's pretty fresh. Yeah, it might be. Let's not stick around. Yeah, well... I wasn't planning on sticking around. Alright, let's try and get through here as quick as we can, because I got a bad feeling about this. Uh oh, more cartridges, more magazines, lots of magazines. Damn. Look at this. Look how many rounds these guys were popping off. I'd love to have that much ammo. Another one. Shit. Well, at least we've got two of our three bullets back. Let's have a little read filled ops log. 
Uh, M254 E field operations log arrived grid 2438 A negative contact moving patrol west towards city center negative contact negative fucking contact private alt water reports visual sound contact stage 2 cordyceps infected near collapsed office building moving to investigate why would you move to investigate Surely you would you wouldn't have orders to attack the zombies unless they were threatening the, the, the encampment. I don't know. Multiple infected contacts. Private Altwater, uh, Shah and Coolidge killed in action. So these guys died waiting for back. Yeah. Yep, well, <laughs> let's not be like them. If we can help it. Because, you know, the dead know only one thing. It is better to be alive. Ooh, stuff. If you know that quote, I'm impressed. I love that quote. Okay, let's keep... Ooh, hello. Hello, sexy. God damn it. Clicker. Years of infection will do to you. Sort of. They see using sound. Like bats. If you hear one clicking, you gotta hide. That's how they spot you. Holy shit. Look at that thing. And look at the way its uh, cordyceps is actually split from the body and released the spores. Holy crap. Yeah. Yeah. Not very nice, to be honest. Hmm. I wouldn't want to touch it. Oh, that looks gribbly. That looks like there's spores coming off from it. Oof. No, thank you. Yeah, look at the big spores. Oof. Won't want to breathe that shit in. But I do like the attention to detail. Oh, there we go. Our torch is running out. So we better shake the old... Uh, Shake the old uh, controller there, <clears throat> and if you think that gets annoying, it does. The building feels like it's about to fall apart. It's a rather pointless gimmick. All right. Well, if this building's Watch about to fall head. apart, we don't really want to spend too much time here, to be honest. Oof. Yeah. Don't breathe. Don't fart. Don't even think. This place is about to come down around our ears. Oh, that's disappointing. That's the one thing on medium. You don't really find a lot of... Um, or I should say, you find too much uh, in the way of crafting materials. You never, you can never use it all. Give me a hand with this. Come on, Tess. Let's do this. Teamwork is dream work and all that. Oh, Christ. That is not what you want in your face. And it slapped me. Motherfucker slapped me. You alright? It's nothing. Search for supplies. That definitely wasn't nothing. Holy crap. I love looking at these guys. I mean, Tess kind of blew that one's brains out, or what little it had left of its mushroom brain, but damn. Let's get the hell out of here. Yeah, let's go look for stuff first. And here we have a ship door. Yoink, our first one. Yeah, we're going to use that. Open that boy up. Alright, let's actually use a med kit as well, because we are bingo health right now. Okay, ooh, five bullets. Nice. That's a result and a half. 25 scrap. Now, like supplements, uh, which are used to permanently upgrade Joel, scrap we use to upgrade our weaponry. We, ooh, nice. But you can only upgrade your weaponry at um, weapon benches. 
but they do give us nice what is going on with the frame rate I keep getting lag I never get lag you never get lag playing this on PS4 Pro it was pretty rock solid on the vanilla PS4 that's unusual oh well whatever okay right yeah I think I'll have the brick I like the brick I don't know if like one's better than the other the bottle over the brick I'm not sure here catch yourself up thank Appreciate you it. oh yeah she's just allowed us to make medkits um, medkits are great obviously you know um, but there's not that many type of resources there's only six different types of resources but there's actually a fair few things we can make so some items require the same resources to s construct so you have to be a little bit tactical sometimes not so much on this difficulty but certainly on the harder difficulties now I've never completed this on grounded which is the hardest difficulty but my my friend has and it's nuts to say the least they've removed loads of checkpoints they've made the enemies st stupidly hard because they seemingly always know where you are and um, is everything is like one hit kill alright so we ain't going that way so follow me ladies I got an idea. Ooh, damn. Look at this dude. Up there. Look. Yay. Yeah, this guy got rumbled. Right, let's go. Just see if there's a way through. Pretty sure there's gonna be a way through. Be pretty weird if there wasn't. It's clear. Come on, Ellie. Alright, kid, you're up. Come on. Nice work. I would have thought Joel would have gone up first. Come on, big guy. Give me her hand. All right, all right. Stop flirting with me, for God's sakes. Let's go. Clickers? Shit. Go, go. Well, that's awkward. <laughs> okay, so shit is about to go down. Now clickers, these are the guys that are one hit kill. These guys you really don't want to play with. And they're quite hard to put down with a pistol. Can be done, but survival is not guaranteed. Right, those candy bars are health items, but you cannot take them with you. They're kind of uh, situationally used. Right, let's get out of here. Alright, good enough. I'm pretty sure she will use the entire med pack as well. If you have to defend yourself against her. Right. I think that's it. Ellie, you okay? Other than shitting my pants. <laughs> I'm fine. Let's go. Uh oh. Ellie shit her pants. That's it. Never let her oh never Give me a second. Ooh. Yeah, never let her forget that. That <laughs> crowning moment. <laughs> she should have had us. There you go, ladies. Alright. Come on. Alright, let's do this. The stairwell's blocked. Should we go back up? Uh, this is crazy. Uh, I'll admit, Just it's not the safest. Are you serious? Right, let's get out of here. Ok, 
Okay. Um, this is like really sketch. I'm just saying. Whoa. Oh man. Come on, Ellie. Yeah. Oh man, this is dodge. Okay, everyone, hold on to your ass. Okay, that's fine. Well, that's kind of fine. Say a lot of nothing. Hmm. Well, we've got a nice board here, and we're definitely going to use that bad boy. Yoink! These boards. Ooh, yes, and a new gun, a revolver. It's only six rounds, and it takes longer to reload, but it has a little bit more punch. You can carry uh, you carry more guns than you have holsters. Extra guns are stored in your inventory and can be swapped with equipped with an equipped gun. Yeah, so basically we have one holster for each weapon type. I believe spoiler, there's four weapon types, um, but we have to craft those later on, so we don't have access to those just yet. Really, you want me to do it? I know how to do it, game. It really is okay. Honestly, it's fine. We're gonna. Put the juicy gun away for now. Stay with the group. I say juicy. It's, it's it's a bit of a step up, but it's not like the second coming of Jesus or anything. Oh boy, we've got to drop down. And, ladies and gentlemen, ooh, of that instead. Crowbar does more damage. Right, and ladies and gentlemen, with that. I'm going to end this video. So, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Glad that we actually managed to get through that. Oof. Oof, without me talking too much shit. And hopefully the audio is good this time. So, thanks for watching, guys. And as always, till next time. And Happy New Year.